Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Boom! It's Sonic time! Did I just hit restart uh, or continue, or what did I do? I... <laughs> I don't know, dude. You're... I'm not even in the same house as you. Oh, okay. Woohoo! I can't see what's going on. Yeah, I think I restarted the stage. Whatever. Yeah. It's just more no, Sonic for me! <laughs> oh my god. Wait, didn't we say we were gonna talk about something in the last episode? Oh my and god, like, we'll yes. we'll probably forget. Yes. No! What was it? I don't remember. It was something about m movies or like dr dreams. Oh, so something about nutrition. Something about <laughs> y you were you were eating something. Burger King. Burger fast food. Burger King fast food. Correct. Okay. Yeah. So. Oh, thank God. We I have never heard the end of that one, dude. I used to love. You know me, man. I'm a Wendy's guy, dude. I love going to Taco Bell and stuff like. I used yep. to do it all the time, and like, you know, I still led a pretty healthy life. Like, I was- I was working out, like, four days a week, and, um, you know, I'd- I'd cook a lot of my own meals and stuff, but like, I was like, yeah, I fucking love fast food, man, this place is awesome. So, because of the- the- the q -teen, because of the Backstreet Boys, yes. uh, we, um, I've been cooking, like, three times a day, every day. Um, which is like, you know, that's its own thing. Mm -hmm. But th th there's stuff coming out about how like, oh, you know, nobody's nobody's gotten tickets to the Backstreet Boys tour from fast food. There's not a single recorded case. Um, okay. So I was like, all right, well, you know what? Let's let's do it. Like, let's let's just go out and, and get get some faves. You know, so you know, we we did we did Taco Bell once and we did Burger King once. Um, because I, I, Wendy's is very far away from here. Um, right. there are not that many Wendy's in LA. Uh, but both times, man, I just felt terrible. Like, absolutely terrible. And I'm like, is yeah. this how I always felt every time I ate fast food and I just didn't notice? Cause like, I was doing it more commonly? Like, it, it, it it's certainly possible. Unreal how bad I felt. Like and, and and Susie too. She was like, Oh, this sucks. And I was like, Oh man, I know. So, um I don't think I'm gonna be having a whole lot of fast food after the the world opens up again. Yeah, I noticed a difference when I stopped eating it too. Like and I never wanna come across like, oh, I know the best way to eat. Like, cause I eat plenty of sugar and candy and garbage. Um, it's just, fast food specifically, like, stopped appealing to me a long time ago. Um, there, I, I watched a documentary, have you ever heard of, uh, Fed Up? No. Aaron? I've seen, like, oh, the okay. thousand other, like, fat, sick, and nearly dead, and, like, super size me. Wow, that sounds really terrible. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I haven't seen that one. This one is, uh, Katie Couric. Uh, put it together after like doing a bunch of news stories and um, realizing oh this is a real problem it, really interesting um, and it was talking about how uh, if we stay on the road we're on by 2050 just from like a pure numbers perspective um, a third of Americans will have diabetes oh, like, oh man that's wild so um, the gist Forgive me if I get the details of this wrong. The the general gist was um, that in the 70s, a group of uh, politicians, bipartisan, uh, got together and wanted to wanted people to try to be more healthy. Um, and so they put this commission together that realized that there was a lot of fat in American foods. Um, so they uh, put together a a group that would, um, as a policy, remove the fat from a lot of foods. Like, um, when you, that's when you started seeing diet stuff and, um, uh, lean, uh, like, like those words entered the advertising lexicon. Right. The problem was, uh, when you take the fat out of food, it tastes like crap. Yeah. So, the, the way the food companies got around it was to, keep the fat out, but replace the fat with sugar. Right. And so, which is 
equally bad, if not worse. Um, so now if you look at processed food, um, almost all of it has a fuck ton of sugar in it. Oh yeah. Um, and there's, and sugar, um, manufacturers are very powerful politically. So if you'll notice like on nutrition facts, um, on the back of whatever you grab, any, pretty much anything out of your fridge, um, if you look at how much, um, vitamin A, fat, whatever is in there, um, it'll give you a percentage of your daily recommended amount. But next to however many grams of sugar there are, there will be no, um, percentage there. Because they, uh, politically got it blocked. Um, so you never know. You, you don't really have a true sense of the insane amount of sugar you're ingesting. Wow. But that is part of the reason why so many Americans, even though they'll eat low-fat things and diet this and diet that, will still gain a ton of weight um, and have a great deal of difficulty because there's there's sugar in everything, like mm -hmm. applesauce and like low-fat yogurt and all, all, all these things which you look at it and you look at the label and you think, oh, that must be healthy, you know? Um, but it's not. Anyway, I, I, I bring this up just because if you do a lot of your own cooking, um, that can be a way to avoid that. Because you're taking, hypothetically, real ingredients, you know. Um, a a as in, I'm sorry, I don't, I don't want to go too preachy about this or talk about it too much, but the, the last thing I'll say about it is that, like, a, a point that it makes is, if you eat an apple, the fiber in the apple will um, sort of counteract the uh, sugars, the natural sugars in the apple, and prevent an insulin spike in your body. Um, whereas if you drink apple juice, that has all of the sugars that, are, that were in the apple, but none of the fiber. So um, it can produce that insulin spike, and it's, it's not that different, according to them, than drinking soda, you know, or... So all these times I thought I was being super healthy by drinking orange juice, um, I, I wasn't. Um, at least the orange juice with all the added sugars and stuff. So, I don't know, man. Simply orange, dude. That's Florida's finest. Is it? I, I, I like, I don't know the, I, I'd sort of have to look at the labels, but like, um, it was, it was a very eye-opening thing. It was called Fed Up. And, uh, and after I watched it, I was like, God, Damn it. Oh, I get it. <laughs> no wonder. Fed, uh, no wonder it. Uh -huh. Yeah, exactly. No wonder it's such a an issue. Um, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I knew that stuff about the, the fat, changing the fat in the 80s, and like fat isn't actually that bad for you. Um, I forget where I saw that. Some documentary, I'm sure. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's just it, loaded with sugar. Like I, I, I can't stand. I, I tried to. I did like no sugar for a while mm -hmm. because like we were cooking our own foods. It was so easy, um, and it was great. <laughs> I felt very healthy. Yeah, yeah. It's difficult though. Like especially especially now during the Backstreet Boys uh, reunion tour, um, which is I gotta tell you, turning out to be a long tour. Oh yeah, they, the, uh, the sh it's like they, they keep they they keep adding new dates <laughs> and extending extend. They're like oh t two shows a night, baby. <laughs> They, 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 their voices must be tired. You'd think, and yet, some people think their voices could go on for quite a long time. <laughs> um, but Sci yeah, anyway, scientists like, are working on ways to to prevent you from just like being so excited about the Backstreet Boys, and uh, they could be working a little faster. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it's I I don't know I don't know what it's like to be a scientist. Um, but I, I do know what it's like to not want tickets <laughs> to see the Backstreet Boys. Oh, yeah. The, that, that's, that's the gist, though. Like, while that tour is going on, it's a, it's a lot tougher to eat healthy. Um, just because so many of the, the food items that I bought in preparation for a long tour are these processed foods, you know, that are meant to last a long time and all that. Yeah, I did. Um, I did a lot. And have of, a lot of added 
I, I, I found out... I, I sort of knew this offhand, but um, I actually looked it up um, about Tuna. Because Tuna was one of the things that we got when we like made our little bunker. Uh, you mm -hmm. know, it was like tunas and pastas and rices and multivitamins and shit. Um, but, uh... Can't eat tuna every day. Can't yeah, even the eat mercury poisoning. Can't even eat tuna every other day. You should, you're supposed to, for for my body weight, which is a lot. Like I'm a fat mm -hmm. man. I, <laughs> <laughs> I, I can only have tuna every three days. Why is that? According to some, because the the mercury. Because of the mercury. Yeah, yeah, and and there's there's some like uh, albacore, I think. White mm -hmm. albacore, I think, is like the good one. It's like half the amount of mercury. It's still a ton of mercury. Like if you're just getting like bumblebee tuna, it's like you gotta wait like four days before you can have another thing of tuna. Really? Or else you get like toxic levels of mercury. I, according to this website, I don't know if this is true, but that was. I, 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 I was mean, like, Whoa. I feel like I've I've heard about the mercury Oops. issues in two. <laughs> I just love how- oh my god, that was a long fall. Yeah. I love how, like, these rings are gently coming down in a very clear, like, follow this and get all the rings kind of formation. And then- Oh my god, you, you gotta be <laughs> kidding me! You have to be kidding me! I pressed the button to follow the rings and it didn't follow the rings and it just rolled me off the edge! Yeah. I gotta go and through like, that whole got, damn level again! You got, like, two rings, and Sonic was like, yeah! And then you fell off the cliff. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Man, I should pretty probably, sweet. I should probably play as these other stupid characters. Yeah, be Team Dark, bro. I want to be Team Charmy because Charmy's so dumb. T Charmy. Yeah, Charmy the Bee. You never I seen Charmy remember. the Bee, dude? No, who's Charmy the Bee? He's a little bee. Then <laughs> he's like, that's Bwah! that was the extent of what I knew about him. <laughs> oh my god, I got to do all this shit again. This is a nightmare. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's just a tiny little bee, and he's got, like, a stupid helmet on, and he looks dumb, and everyone doesn't like him. Charmy the Bee! <laughs> was he in one of your, um... Yes, he was in the cartoon. Knuckles Chaotix? Yeah. He's the, why am I attached to the bee? Je Jesus, you know? No, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Boy, that was a long time it, ago. It really was. It was quite a long time ago. I, I, yeah. Uh, We've been on the internet a long damn time. Yeah, and it fe it feels like, yeah, it, like it, at this point it does. It's it's starting to feel like an actual long time because you know, like the internet, it's like oh, it's a year. It's like oh, that's like a century in internet time. But like yeah. it's, it actually does feel like man, that was a long time ago. Yeah. Let let me. Let, well, let us. Um, because I'm sure you feel the same way. Let's take a quick moment. Um, to just deeply. Deeply and truly thank the lovelies for supporting us for this long uh, and letting us do this. Yeah, absolutely. Because my god, like, it's a fun job and I, even when I, even when I joined, I never dreamed that it might last this long. Oh, um, 100%. When we first started, it was like, I was like, yeah, this is like a two-year thing. And then after two yeah, years, yeah. I was like, alright, well, I guess it's like a, it's like five, five years. And then at year five, I was like, I have no idea what- how long this is gonna go now. Um, yeah, yeah. And not like- I'm not saying like, I wish it was that long and then it went longer. I'm just no. saying like, I just thought there was a shelf life to this show. Like, I thought the, yeah. it would be out of fashion or... I don't know. The, the, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. I, I like- I don't want it to come across like, Oh god, we've been doing this a long time, you know? I, it's- we're fucking- Elated that we've gotten a chance to do this for so long, um, and so yeah, as long as as long as everyone keeps wanting us to do it, we'll 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 do it, man. Yeah, and it's gone through like phases too. It's been it's been around long enough where it's like I can remember times where like oh man, I was really enjoying it, and then I was like oh man, like I was really not enjoying it, and like now it's like oh I'm really enjoying it. Like it's it's just yeah, really yeah. strange. Strange like relationship with something when it's, it goes on for eight years Yeah, and and my my seventh anniversary For grumps is gonna be this month in June Ooh. Um, Yeah, ain't that something Ooh. seven? 
I mean, outside of... Outside of NSP... I don't think I've ever done anything for seven years, you know? Um... Cocaine? You can't do cocaine for seven years. <laughs> That's too much cocaine. <laughs> That's like tuna. <laughs> you can only have cocaine three times. To, uh, cocaine is the tuna of, of <laughs> snorty drugs. <laughs> snorty drugs. <laughs> I, I don't do cocaine in, in case the, me labeling it as a snorty drug did not give that away. <laughs> is that a snorty um, drug? I don't even know. Yeah, yeah. You've never watched an 80s movie where, like, they're, they're doing, uh, they're, they're on Wall Street and... The blowing lines, dude. In the in the fifties, they couldn't even have a husband and wife sleeping in the same bed together. Like, who knows if That's the true. if the the lame stream media? No. <laughs> oh my God! Please don't even. No. Who even knows if media is is lying to us about yes. cocaine? Got it. Are we gonna get? Maybe we should edit out the word. I feel like YouTube's gonna be like, "What are you guys talking about over here?" Yeah. Especially when you just basically said, is the media, like, take the red pill and realize that cocaine is the best. Like, don't take that tact, man. Not even jokey style. Yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> Not even jokey style. Oh, man. Oh, boy. But yeah, so, it's, no, like, that. that's... That's all I wanted to say in terms of, like, the thank you stuff, because, man, even through, even through things like this, um, I can honestly say the Backstreet Boys tour would have sucked 200 times harder, um, for me personally, if I didn't have the fun of getting to do this show, uh, with you, Aaron, uh, and for you, lovelies. 100%. It is, it is, I am, we are truly, truly hashtag blessed. <laughs> that we have some like I, I we can work like there's so many people yeah. that can work right now I'm like oh I'm so yeah. grateful that we can work um we don't take it for granted really keeping me sane right now just to have some normalcy you know like oh there's mm -hmm. something on my schedule and then I have to like do a thing that requires like quality <laughs> that was funny <laughs> 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 Of, of me, like, oh, that's, that's neat. Yeah, and don't get us wrong, like, the Backstreet Boys tour sucks balls. <laughs> like, they, we're not trying to say, like, man, this is, this is great. No. But we're, 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 we're I just said it's it keeping me sane. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, I would, I would point. be in a very different place if I didn't have, like, a work to be doing that feels, like, yeah. productive. And, yeah. and, like, I'm contributing to something. I feel the same way. I feel the same way. It's, uh, it's been very nice, and, um, th th this, I guess I'm just thinking about it more, because now we're recording separately, f even from each other, and, and that, that is a new level of feeling the, the change in, in life, you know? Yeah, absolutely. The, the, the big changes in life, you know? It's also especially weird to talk about all the serious <laughs> stuff while the drum beat is like do do da do da do do da do do da in the background. Wow, wow, wow! Absolutely. Well, at least we can get together and play Sonic Heroes. You better believe it. The best of them all, the one that people love the most. That that and Catatonic Youth. That's the other thing that's been keeping me sane. <laughs> my my favorite Instagram. Yeah, that thing's brilliant. Have you seen the one with the kid uh, who's singing about his pool party? <laughs> no, but you've instantly sold me. Yeah, I love him. It, it's like catatonic youth can get a little, uh, a little bitey. Yeah, you know, uh, sometimes because um, a lot of it is people who are giving terrible performances, but absolutely are convinced they're amazing. Yeah. Um, Dunning-Kruger. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, so the comments can get pretty, pretty intense. Um, but the comments towards this kid were very supportive. Oh, really? Um, they were like, yo, 
this kid can can crush it like killing the falsetto. <laughs> um, it's, it's just it's just the whole thing made me very happy. Well, that's the approach, can right? Can you not get these rings, by the way? You can, but you have to press the the square button, and you saw how that worked out. This is where I died last. Yeah, got it. Um, so I'm just it's trying just to, not worth just it. Just trying to play it safe. Yeah, just, play cool. Just trying to trying to stay six feet away from these rings. Mm -hmm. Wear a mask. <laughs> yeah. Treat these- treat each of these rings as if they were a member of the Backstreet Boys. Yeah, exactly. You want to stay away. Stay as far away as- I mean, the moment you- you even talk to a Backstreet Boy, I mean, they're- they're guaranteed- you're just, like, convinced. You're like, I gotta get tickets. You don't even want lawn seats for that show. <laughs> <laughs> even if they're in a like, day, you know, you go to one of those, like, those places where it's like, Oh, dude, I can get you some cheap seats for this. It's 20 bucks. And it's like, oh, sweet. You don't want no, those. you don't even- yeah, you don't even want to be in the parking lot with binoculars. <laughs> they'll play this, this music. Yeah, they'll play this song at the concert. Oh, come on, man. Wait, why did I get all of my rings back? This this, this game is baffling me, like, yeah, forward and I, backwards. I thought you kept getting hit, but you retained six rings all the time. Yeah. Yeah. I got a lot of questions, man. Oh. That one ring out of that situation. You know, it's weird. It it feels um what we're doing right now. Ow, oh, fudge off. It feels a little uh um podcasty in a way. It does. Be it does a little bit. Because at least in my configuration, I don't know if it's the same for you, but um I have a direct monitor on my voice, so I can hear myself, which is very podcasty. I um, cannot hear myself. Yeah. So that it's like a different because it. it just by its very nature, it makes you want to like, like, here I am on the mic and I'm talking, and, I'm <laughs> and that's why every podcast sounds like that because they can hear themselves. And there's just something about like, when you're talking to a mic and you can hear yourself, you just want to be like, you, you just want to do this. And you, so I'm yeah, like, well, you you feel like you don't need to project, yeah, like as I'm, much. I'm fighting the urge. Oh, yeah, because you can, yeah, because it's like, oh, this is the length, this is the volume I need. I don't know, whatever. Um. Shh. Meanwhile, I'm bringing it as hard as I possibly can, <laughs> like I always do. On the tiny, the bottom of the screen with your forehead. Wow. Um. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> I think it said, let Tails do this. Yes, so. yes. It's, it's Tails, and then you have to switch to Sonic for like a small segment, and then you have to switch back to Tails right afterwards. And Ooh, they, and they baby. Don't, and they, fuck. And they don't give you much time. Why can't I do the dang air dash when I'm- after I'm hurt, you fool? FOOL! Hold, please. Wow! Aaron, can, Aaron, can, can you hold the fort for like 10 seconds and I'll be right back? Yeah. Thanks, bud. Uh-oh. What's the dog? Leave this to me! Goo, goo, goo! I would leave it to you if you didn't bump it up all the time! What, is he stuck? He's stuck under the thing! Oh my god, that wasn't even my fault! Oh, frickity frack. Tickety tack, baby. <laughs> okay, got it. Okay. Um, I'm back. Yeah. I just had to listen to, um, the kids' pool party song. Oh, okay, um, so you could, like... So I could get it back into my head. Yeah. It's like... Come to my pool party Before we go back to school and it is so great. It starts off with his mom being like, Hey, Will, who'd you invite to your pool party? And he's like, Almost everyone at school! <laughs> and it's so, like, genuine and fun and, like, all the other, um... All the other, uh... Bands on the, um, Catatonic Youth site are, like, these screamo, like... <laughs> girls! You know, like, yeah. that, and then you and then you get to his and it's like... Come to my pool party before we go back to school. Is that Shakira? What's that? In your it sounds a little like Shakira. <laughs> I will. We've got work. Uh, sorry, I I got really frustrated because that level was absolute dog shit bullshit. Um, okay. And I am not taking that back, and I am not apologizing for that take because that level was terrible. Um, okay. And uh, I went to the Chaotix plotline, I guess. I love it. Who's who's this? Who's this purple friend? Uh, so that's Espio. 
Um, I don't think I've... Have I encountered him or her before? He's like a chameleon. Um, so he can, like, change colors. Uh, and then there's Charmy the Bee, who is a bee, and he sucks. And then right. there's, um, Vector. Um, I love, I love Vex. Yeah, he's That's a, my boy. He's a croc. He's a cool croc, and I've played it- Oh god, do we have to start from the beginning? Well, yeah, I think- I'm- I'm gonna give this a shot, because I've never played Sonic Heroes before. I know nothing about it, other than you play with the other characters at the same time. Um, Wait, is this the one people like? This- this one is very divisive. There, oh, okay. there are th there are people that really really love this game, and there are people that think it's absolute garbage. Hmm. So, uh oh. I think I think Vex just went. uh... Hey, have you seen any crabs in this area? <laughs> and I don't like it when I hear a grown man say that. <laughs> have you seen Aaron did any crabs? Oh. <laughs> What's that? Wait. Sorry. So, so, Sometimes our audio drops out from each other, uh, or there's like a little latency, and it makes it hard for us to hold a conversation a little bit. Yeah. So, um, Aaron, if you're ever talking and you hear me go, Aaron, <laughs> just ignore that. Okay. <laughs> I'll figure out what's going on eventually. I just thought you you missed me already. I haven't talked for one second, and now it's like I oh I remember the days Buddy? when we used to talk. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? So Not this is you. basically the same shit. SBO is the fast one, Ve Vector is the strong one, and Charmy is the fly. Yeah, I would imagine they're all different variations on that theme, so, right? So this is a total waste of my time. I should just should be playing that stupid level again. Oh, Speed, power, fly. Maybe this is a little different. Oh, hello. Whoops, whoops. I don't remember this part, unless I'm dumb. I guess we were t no, I do remember this part. Man, yeah, I don't I want- it's the same damn level! I don't- This is a waste of my time! Okay. I need to- I need to advance with the real characters of the game, not these stupid fake-ass... Crocodile-ass, B-ass... <laughs> damn! Chameleon-ass- like, I don't give a dunk! Yeah. Uh, yeah. I just had to take a swig of louder. It might make you feel better if you come to my pool party before we go back to school. God, <laughs> sorry. Can we do a cover? My voice isn't my voice isn't warmed up. <laughs> the uh yeah, of course we could do a cover. I'll have to ask his permission though. Yeah. Definitely. Maybe his parents' permission. Yeah, probably. He looks like he's maybe 8. Oh my god, I love it. Good dude, if if a, a number one Nielsen charting band. I'm just blowing smoke up my own ass. Uh, <laughs> covered this kid's song. Like how? He'd be. Oh, you mean a star bomb like, did it? Yeah, yeah, or you know, just yeah, exactly. Mm. That would be amazing, dude. I don't know if we ever talked about it on the show, but I just recently learned. That the kid who sang "I Just Want to Play Video Games" died. Yeah, he died in sadly. a car accident. Yeah. Oh, it's so sad. No, it sucks. It was. I, it, it, I, it was like uh, all. It was all fun and games, right? Like until that happened, and everyone was like, "Man." <laughs> yeah, like sucks. I wanted. I wanted him to live a full happy life. Yeah, like I, you. You know what I really wanted? I wanted the like. You know, the six years later moment where it was like, hey, what's that kid up to now? And it's like, it turns out he's like the guitarist of Def Leppard or something. It's like, what the, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I wanted that well, to happen for him. I think he was 20 when he died. So he, mu he must have been, like, it must have been fairly recently. Uh, it was a, it was a couple years ago, at least. Man. How long ago was the I Just Want to Play Video Game song? Oh my god, I mean, the lyrics are Xbox, GameCube, PlayStation 2. Knew all about them as uh, soon as they're new, so... It's <laughs> quite a while ago. <laughs> god, I love that song. Oh, I mean, it's... It... It more than most songs. It more than most, like, chart toppers. Mm -hmm. Uh, ends up in my head in the middle of the day. Oh yeah. It's so catchy. And it's true. It's it's true to your life. It it, it totally is. 
Just wanna play video games. I think that's that's the real quality of it too. Is is that it's um it's it's true like because you know when you're in a situation and it's like oh take my shoes off one two buckle my shoe or you know that's a terrible example but <laughs> one two buckle my shoe <laughs> did you just claim that as a relatable situation sure. When was the last time shoes had buckles? Man, I don't know, the Renai sauce? <laughs> when I go to the Renai sauce fair? Okay, fair enough. Um, why can't I go all the way? Why won't it let me- this stage is absolutely terrible. This is the worst thing that's ever happened to me. Um, wow. it's fu- it's funny watching... <laughs> screamy annoyed Aaron and gentle podcast Aaron just like... <laughs> Fight for control of your body. <laughs> That's this so is, true. Uh, this is bullshit. <laughs> I can't deal. Well, I don't want to. I'm. I'm. You know, and this is going to change very quickly. But I'm. I'm. I'm being a little self-conscious of the fact that like this. It's not real life, and like when I scream, you can kind of be like, ah, you know, and like lean away or whatever. Like if I scream, it's going to blow out your headphones. Right. So, like, I'm trying not to... <laughs> trying not to get there. But, uh, I guess that's what the audience has to put up with all the time, so... Well, the- the audience has, uh, that mitigating, um... Uh, factor on the audio. Like, oh. that that tones down screams That's right, we have the compression. The compression, thank yeah. you. Uh... Whereas... My- my baby ears, <laughs> as our boy Finn would say, uh... <laughs> they hurt. Oh, they- oh, oh, they hurt. My baby hurt ears? Them. Was that from an episode he was on? That was- yeah, that was him commenting on us cursing around him. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, dude, my baby ears hurt. <laughs> uh, I hope he's hanging in there. I'm sure he's fine. Yeah, I- um, I, I, I spoke to him recently. He's doing- he's doing good. Yeah. Well, he's so busy. Um... Uh -oh. Well, well, oh god. Well, well... Will occasionally like get memes from him. Oh yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> I, th I I think I think I sent him the. Uh, He's a memester. Yeah. Oh, he loves the memes. The 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 one. Um, oh God, what was it? Like, oh, hold on, I have to find it. I I don't want to. You don't want to misappropriate a meme. That's exactly right. Well, so so much of what makes them funny is the exact wording. Oh yeah, the specificity of it. Yeah. Yeah, uh... Yeah, that's right. It's, um... The- the hash- the caption is me when I'm finally allowed back at Olive Garden. <laughs> and it's, uh... It's someone grating cheese, like Parmesan cheese, onto, like, a meal. And you just see Kylo Ren screaming, MORE! <laughs> MORE! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's so true. It's perfect. Hold on, I'll play the audio at least. <laughs> Can't even hear it. Could, could you hear him at the end there? No, it like completely cut. Discord was like, "That's not. That's too much." I'm just gonna edit oh. it out. Hold on, let me let me let me hold it a little bit back. Sorry, we're kind of learning, kind of <laughs> learning on the job here. No, not happening. I think it just sees it as background noise. Oh, interesting. Like it so it thinks just it's cuts like a, it out? Yeah, it thinks it's like a TV in the background or something, and it's like, mm -mm, forget it. Wow. Yeah. Discord is very smart. Hey, man, they've been doing it a long time. The only thing I hate about Discord is their stupid fucking memes that they throw in. Easy to, now. Dude, I'm, like, Discord, great service. I don't know anything about the people that make it, other than they're, they really love memes, and I'm so sick of it. Whenever, like, something doesn't- doesn't work and it's like, Oops, looks like all our base are belong to us. It's like, shut up, dude! I'm frustrated right now. <laughs> <laughs> Just respect my intelligence for a fucking second, dude. Anyway. <laughs> next time on wow, Game Grubs. Yes. Oh, well, alright, uh, next time on Game Grubs. <laughs> I feel you. I'll- I'll be- uh, I'll- I'll be, like... Further. Farther? I hope. <laughs> yeah, this okay. This has been, like, 40 minutes of this fucking stage over and over again. This stage blows, dude. 
It's yeah, really you made bad. That clear. It's really bad. It, it, fight me, like in the in the comments. <laughs> like fight, I'll be checking the comments on this one. <laughs> fight me. I will absolutely go toe to toe with you about this level. If anybody's like, no, you're just doing it. It's like, no, this sucks. This sucks ass. The, all right, anyone, like. It's been our policy for a very long time, years, I think, not to engage uh, with people in the comments, because it's it's just not worth it, man. Um, like, it, too much can get misinterpreted, and you, you, I don't know. Like, we abstain from that, but here's your, here's your moment. Anyone who's ever wanted to pick a fight directly with Aaron, specifically regarding Sonic and, <laughs> and one of its levels, this is the episode. This is it, man. He will be- he will be in there, and he will be responding to your responses. <laughs> he, he, like, every- every- every big comment is gonna have 20 replies, and 10 of them are gonna be Aaron. <laughs> are you sure you're ready for this, dude? Oh, dude, I- I'm getting, like, I'm getting chills just thinking about it, like, <laughs> is this something that I've always wanted? I don't- I don't know, apparently. Oh, I- I don't- I don't like fighting. I'm ready to I'm, go, dude. I'm ready to, like, <laughs> knuckle down and just- and just fucking throw hands. Oh my god, alright! Uh, alright, we'll- we'll- we'll see you in the comments! <laughs> are you- Aaron, are you ready to end our careers? H hell yeah, dude. <laughs> like, in the same episode that we talked about how grateful we are to have been able to do this for so long. <laughs> <laughs> All y'all are so wonderful to us, and this is so- FUCK EVERYONE WHO LIKES THIS STAGE! Alright, <laughs> right, bye everyone. Wow. Alright, goodbye.